Hey, welcome guys to my YouTube channel, Kindles Exploration. So if you are having a short, small sort of vacation and you are planning to come to Barrie, uh, in this video, it's going to be really, really interesting and I'm going to show you uh, things to do around here. Uh, like it is a small city uh, and if you see, there is a Simcoy Lake and a little lake uh, towards the north side. So I'll be explaining you all the things in the short video. And um, there is a trail around the um, Simcoy Lake. It has like 11 stops around it uh, for about 6.1 km. Uh, the Barry Transit here, like the population is very small. It's a vacation time and um, it's really peaceful here. So um, I'll cover all the things in the video. I hope you'll enjoy with me. So let's start this video vacation in Barry. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on, hold on. So that is just a reminder, if you are in Canada and if you are going outside to explore things, just keep that in mind, always to watch the weather details first, because it, there is a saying that in Canada, weather can change anytime. Weather can change badal sakta hai, kabhi barish, kabhi windy, kabhi snow, achanak. So let's check the weather and it shows around two degrees. The time is around 11 a.m. So I think, um, it will be fine just wearing a trench coat or something so now let's start the video hey welcome guys so let's start our journey today in Barry. so i'm just leaving my house right now and uh, walking towards the allendale go train station so this station is nearby my house uh, and uh, like besides it if you will look only a nearby like uh, 200 to 200 meters there is uh, Simcoy Lake so first we'll be going towards the train station from there we'll be going uh, towards the trail and then I will show you all the scenic beauties and um, what all stops are there in the trail so be with me stay with me guys and enjoy this things to do here in Barry. let's start We have reached the Allardale waterfront station and uh, as you see there is no people here like most of it is empty because this is not a busy station and um, if you see like this route uh, starts from the Toronto Union station and it's like quite luxurious services this GO uh, company provides so behind me if you I don't think you might be able to see but uh, there is a go train parked over there and from there uh, towards the left side we are going to start our walking trail so that's what I said it's almost near to the Simcoy Lake so let's go towards the train and uh, uh, join towards the trail So hey guys, I have finally reached uh, this point number one and it's a natural heritage. So every uh, stop we have given some information di gai hai pe. and uh, like, uh, they have given us some information with every stop and we are going to start from here so what is it like this is the starting point and the ending point is towards that side um, like uh, on the next side of the lake so we have here a u-turn uh, like you will if you see that uh, this whole city is situated on the banks of waterfront in a u-shape 
so this is where i'm starting from one end i will go front i'll take a u turn and i'll be reaching towards that end so it's a trail of uh, 6.1 kilometers and it will be very exciting so uh, i'll show you all the sceneries uh, all the stops in between and uh, there are some beautiful attractions coming too so let's start walking so that was the end we started we are going all towards this side and we will be going straight forward we will be taking u turn and we will be reaching that point So we are at point 2 of the trail and this was the thing I was talking about as you can see on the next side of the lake. So that is our destination, that side and um, hopefully it will be very exciting walking such a large trail. So here we are number 4 pe aaye hai. and uh, like from the number 4 uh, there is Allendale village where the waterfront railway station is there of go. So here we have reached at number 4 and 4 and 5 are almost together and then we are starting to take a curve towards the right side of the U-turn. So we have passed uh, the number 5 and uh, here we see that almost um, students, young age people, old people, everyone walk. Uh, they spend their time here like walking, seeing the uh, like beautiful nature, uh, having that freshness, air and all. So it's a good time here if you want to spend vacation. So next we'll be approaching towards the beach, uh, Senantiel, and then there is a uh, sculpture.
so i have reached here at the senential uh, beach and um, there is one thing about here in summer that there are going to be events and all those stuffs here where uh, the people will go inside the water um, having some sort of air balloon type they will put inside the water and they will all be enjoying over here so don't miss the summer if you are in Barry. also uh, we are in the between of the lake now and we are going to approach towards the downtown so in downtown uh, we'll go towards the Barry transit to collect today's pass so there is a map on the screen as you can see all the routes where the downtown is and uh, all like how it is structured all over the city so you can pause the video you can check those images and uh, let's move further towards the downtown So as you can see because it's still a bit winter and the spring is going to approach uh, the boats are aside uh, they haven't been kept in the water but we have reached our destination number eight the spirit catcher so this is a spirit catcher and uh, when i came with one of my friend <laughs> i'll tell you one interesting joke he said to me that if you stand between these three pillars uh, the person will lose his consciousness and he won't be able to think something or anything. So if you live in Barry or uh, if you are coming to visit here, just um, let me know in the comment section if it is true or not. What are your things and if you tried here, do not forget to comment down. That was an interesting music guitar play I've heard. It was refreshing uh, <laughs> sitting at the down of the spirit catcher. So now we are going straight towards the downtown of Barry and the transit is here only. It's not that far. It's just crossing the street and next to it. So let's go towards the downtown and purchase the transit ticket. So.
So this one is the Barry Transit Terminal. It's not that far and it is connected with the police station. So here yeah, the downtown is very small but uh, it is pretty good here. So finally have collected the day pass today and it's a bit cheap here so if you are uh, having tourism around here for one day uh, this will help you better this is the back side is the Barry police station and uh, uh, I can, uh, I've shared a uh, image on this video if you want to buy passes what are the rates you can see here it's the new rates that are in effect right now so that might help you and if you are walking over this trail and if you want some refreshments like um, water and you want to go to washrooms and all then here in the Barry Transit Terminal you can do it. <laughs> this is a tip to you. So yeah, so this is it. Now we will go back to our trail. So we have made up to number 9 that is downtown so from here all the downtown starts it's not that big but according to city it's quite good and amazing so you will see lights and all those stuffs in this Barry 3d icon and all when the, uh, it is night time so as of now we have reached till number 9 now we are going towards number 10 that is east end and after that number 11 is far far away so we will continue our journey when you'll just walk a bit forward from the Barry 3d sign there are these EV charging stations so if you are having Tesla or any electric vehicle, you do not need to worry because uh, they have set up here the charging stations, electric ones. So this is the point where we'll turn towards the right side, towards the other end of the U-turn. So after that, we'll be just walking straight toward the end of the walking trail. And here there are some very amazing amazing scenarios i cannot even describe in the video but it feels so great having this solo journey so there are some interesting things and uh, about this uh, uh berry and uh, like uh, i i am posting it in this video images all so uh, you can read it and i am getting to know some interesting things so this is a trail, very good and there was one sign written which I have uh, shown here in this video that from 10 to around that time, um, morning time, uh, the trail is going to be closed. So be aware of that and it seems that there is construction going on at this end.
so as you can see we can the go train is visible towards that end where we started our journey from the point one so we are almost towards the johnson's beach and are about to reach but before we reach there i want to show you something interesting so as you can see this lake when it is solid frozen uh, during winters here uh, people come here and they do skatings they fly kites and all stuff so it's very very amazing i'll show you a short clip of that video now I think we have arrived to the Johnson's beach. We have to step down from the stairs and we are finally here. Hi guys, so I'm here at the Johnson's Beach, and uh, this is the amazing view here. Half of the lake is covered with ice, so we are like close enough from the 11th stop. So we'll be going towards those stop, and then we'll be ending this journey. and that is it the 11th number pole so finally we have made it and this was an exciting journey going through all the sculptures beautiful places all the stops i saw many people like uh, playing guitar doing their hobby work uh, enjoying nature sitting at the banks of the um, lake and they are just reading they are just uh, enjoying themselves some of them are listening to music so Overall, it was a good experience here at the waterfront of Barrie, and um, I would say if you come during summers, it would be more joyful. But eventually, now during the start of the spring, it was pretty good, and um, I hope you like this video and enjoyed this journey with me. Also, don't forget to subscribe and put your thoughts in the comment section below, so that I will make such videos. Yeah, so that's me signing off with the Canals Explorations Barry video.